Little League football is known for its hard-hitting action. Despite its youth, kids are giving it their all with each play. Even with the smaller players, they go all out and that sometimes equates to big hits. The younger players may have limited experience and understanding, but they are still determined to make every play successful. The hardest hits often come from younger players who need to prove themselves and those who may have had a slow start. Crucial plays can involve huge hits which equal increased intensity, leading to some heartbreaking moments. The biggest hits usually come from the bigger players, or those who are more prone to making big hits. Hundreds of parents in the stands witness these hard-hitting plays all season long. Even though most hits are intentional, they often show the most emotion from the players. Players often lead with their helmets, even when their coaches urge them not to do so. Even with the additional padding and gear, these hits can still make a serious impact. Players have to draw a line between aggression and safety, which can sometimes be difficult. The helmet-to-helmet -helmet hits are some of the hardest and most dangerous. Each hit can be as intense as the next, and often have both players going in for a tackle with reckless abandon. Sometimes these hard hits can even be more intense than hits seen at a professional level. The referees will call a penalty if it appears that there is a potential for harm. These hard hits can be a part of the game, but it is important to stay within the boundaries. Little League football coaches often instruct their players to go in with controlled aggression. It is important for kids to understand the risks of these intense plays, so they can be avoided. Coaches must be aware of their players' abilities and understand how to keep them safe at all times. Injury prevention is always the top priority in these games, just as it is at higher levels. Although there might be a few hard hits throughout a game, it is important to monitor them. Knowing the signs of a concussion can be beneficial, as that is one of the biggest risks associated with hard hits. Even with the necessary precautions, hard hits are still a part of the game. Older players might be stronger, but they are also more aware of the rules, so the hits may not be as hard. Proper form tackling is important in order to prevent injuries, and that begins with understanding the basics.